friends, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to do a segment today that I thought is absolutely appropriate for this time of year, and it is Feeling Crafty. Crafts are probably one of my favorite things to do this time of year, probably because there's not a whole lot to do outside, so while you're stuck inside, you might as well have a lot of fun. Today we're going to be doing something that I thought would be a lot of fun. I've been seeing it on Pinterest all over the place. It looks really simple and very, very elegant. And that is a DIY marbleized coffee mug. Here's a list of the materials that you'll need. One bowl of lukewarm water. Make sure that it's a bowl you don't mind throwing away because it will get messy. And a lot of times it's just easier to throw the bowl away than mess with the hassle of cleaning it up. Next, you'll need a plain white coffee cup. I got this one at Hobby Lobby. It's right across the street from my work. Popped in, it was $7.99, but with your 40% off, it was under $5. Uh, I got a big one because I really love large coffee cups, um, even though they do not fit in my cupboards at all. Um, but you can pretty much find these anywhere. I think the dollar store may even have some, I'm not entirely sure. Um, but definitely don't get anything on it, just plain white. The next thing you'll need, nail polish. I picked out three different colors that I thought would be really fun and kind of blend together nicely. Um, I got a kind of pastel-ish blue, um, a magenta, and then this is kind of a soft pink, kind of opal white color. Next, you're going to need something to mix the colors around in the bowl, and I got this. This was laying around in an art kit, uh, but you can use toothpicks or chopsticks, anything that you can just kind of throw away after. And then some good old paper towel because it's going to get messy. Let's start. So now we're going to start with our first color, which is the blue color. You're going to open it up and pour just a little bit in and let it spread out. Then you're going to take the next color, which is the pinkish color, the magenta. And then we're going to take our soft, light pink opal color. And you're going to gently go across and swirl. Once you swirl it, you're going to take your cup and you're going to stick it straight down into the bowl. Let it set for a couple of seconds to adhere and then you're going to pull straight out. Here we have a marbleized design. You know, it doesn't really look half bad. I was kind of expecting it to look like an atrocious mess, um, but you know, it's not too bad. I kind of like it. Um, the next step is to go ahead and set it on some paper towel, and you're going to leave it for about three to four hours to dry, and then you're going to pat it dry just to make sure you're not rubbing it if it's still wet. Guys, I am so impressed with how this turned out. I always see these things on Pinterest and they look really easy, but then when you get to it, it's a little bit more difficult and it doesn't really turn out the way you think, but this almost looks exactly like it and I'm really happy with what it looks like. The great thing about these is that you can easily find white coffee mugs and you can make a ton of these for Christmas gifts. It was simple, it was all stuff you have around the house basically besides the coffee mug and it took no time at all. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know I did. This was a lot of fun. If you do end up doing this craft, post your pictures below. I'd love to see how yours turned out. If you'd like to see more videos like this, there's a subscribe button at the bottom. Click that and you'll see all my wonderful videos. Thank you guys so much. Have a wonderful week.